arguably biggest weakness, which is his laning stage. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I would fully agree with that, but uh, it definitely seems like he's probably not as good a laner as Miracle is. I think that's probably fair to say. Uh, oh, looks like Kuroki actually gets first right. blood in the first before the Ursa goes down. And Hesta Joe's actually going to be chasing Kuroki here. Only 60 HP. Can Kuroki juke? Give me a couple right clicks, and Hesta Joe will finally get that last hit. Weehan, in the meantime, jumping up ahead a little bit. Just a couple more right clicks to go. The kinetic field will be enough to save good old Hesta Joe. Not a good look. Uh, it obviously depends on the supports as well, right? Like, the Venge 5 is not the strongest support partner you can have in the beginning in this lane. Uh, and they are facing a pretty strong lane, but they similar to what we talked about yeah, with yesterday I feel like they're kind of choosing a lot of their death yet yeah, that starts occurring at seven minutes We Han Kuroki looking to get aggressive on Hesta Joe, but the mid lane looks to be oh, the real action-packed Area right now is miracle with help from GH looks like they're gonna be able to get some scalper. No, it's gonna be really close But miracle goes down first Zeus actually lives and the glimpse back, GH will fall as well. This required Zitrax on the Terror Blade and pretty much the entirety of the team on this lane. Might even chase Weeha, so at half HP at the moment. There's gonna be TP support in the form of GH. Weeha's gonna turn the aggression now. Stampede is popped, and the kinetic field is beautifully placed. Weeha taking additional damage from the Sunderstrike, attempting to get out with that Earth Shock. Smoke was popped for whatever reason, but they're gonna find the Weeha kill first. Kuroki gets dueled. Do they have enough to actually kill him for the damage? Doesn't look to be the case. But okay, I man. do believe that he will fall one way or the other. Although there is some TP coming in. From our Bridge centaur me. boy, just nuke Kuroki. Him, just nuke him. Yeah, he's saving the nuke. is available, saving that for the creeps here. Mind control gets a double hoof stomp, but the inkswell does delay the damage coming out. And finally, definitely dead. The question is how much he can. How much here. dead is? That's the real question, yeah. Cinderin. Oh, meta for that. Okay. Meta. I guess All he right. wants to hit the tower then. Trusty shovel picked up by Miracle. It looks like as my control would pick it up. I hear a duel. It's gonna be on Ursa and Weeha dies again. I, maybe he got Glimpse. No, Glimpse is off cooldown. I'm not sure what he's doing on the other side of the river, but that's quite a few deaths for our boy Weeha. Kuroki in the meantime, press the attack, taking off the magic missile. And that is gonna... Yeah, they have a uh, lot of ways to They're doing a smoke here. here. Zitrax. Triple smoke. Zitrax doesn't have meta, does have Sunder though. You can see the ult come out from the Grimstroke, and they're just gonna turn this around completely as Weeha, I believe. I wanna say that's his fifth death. We'll check here in a second. It's Kuroki's gonna get glimpsed back into Death's Arms. The question is, who's gonna get the last hit? It's gonna be Grimstroke this time around. <laughs> oh, but again, the hero is snowball and if you lose your lane, oh, you're not Weeha. happy. Oh, he's running away this time. Glimpse brings him back into the kinetic field and Static Storm. Nice swap, though, from Kuroki. He's going to be the first to fall. Nice sacrifice for him. Excalibur might be next on the list, though. It's a one for one. Oh, he lost the duel to Ursa. And the damage goes to Ursa. Much needed for Weeha as the chase is now on. Stampede has already been expended. Weeha able to get through the kinetic field. Urshak into that Grimstroke. And just like that, Weeha gets a triple kill. You talking shit, Cinderin? About that build? Huh? <laughs> Do they feel it in the game? Right. I think that's that's kind of an overlooked aspect a lot of the time where oh, casters will be like, why aren't they just pushing? It is enough. That's a good kill. With the laser, that is a huge kill. Later, uh, I think it's it's honestly kind of hard to say. Terrible, it's always that kind of late game wild card who can just win seemingly every game under the right conditions. Oh, they found that GH is very dead. They uh, sure did. And this is at close to the 20 minute mark, so they will be getting this bottom outpost. The yep. top is controlled by Team Nigma, so it'll be a trade of sorts. Uh, 5v4 if they actually want to fight here. Zitrax still has his metamorphosis. Hope Stomp's gonna start off into a double edge, into a magic missile. He's gonna get asunder, keeps him healthy for a little bit longer, but he dies shortly after. Soulbind has been commenced, or has been used onto Weeha and company, but they're relatively healthy. Of course, Weeha himself. Well, looks like we're gonna have a stampede initiation. Kuro in a little bit of trouble. Swaps out, Zitrax pops the BKB, Soulbind onto two, into the double silence actually. And it looks like this Disruptor ult was also used, but only on the Rubik as Weeha attempting to get out of dodge. It's a one for nothing right now, make that two. Weeha pops his BKB, I believe it's the 10 second one. Legion Commander gets a duel off. Will they be able to get the actual kill? It doesn't look like it's gonna be the case, but it's a double kill regardless for Zitrax. A little bit delayed. Weeha on the run, pops his Essence Ring. 
I was completely wrong about this item. Mind control, Mind control now. Weird spot. See, it's a disruptor. See if they can actually find this kill or not. Doesn't look like that's going to happen. But yeah, mind control might be in some trouble, though. Excalibur is here. And yeah, this will be an easy cleanup for Singularity. Wait, we not banned, but to me this looks... I don't know. Oh, he picks up a power. I don't, I don't know what the right word is for that. Oh, stampede initiation. Disruptor gets Yules. Mind control. That's a hook glimmer. Now. Immediate purge on the dust as yeah, well. Disruptor's taking basically no damage. Kuroki is getting melted from Zitrex. The Zitrex is going to change his targets completely. As the Zeus is the first to fall in this engagement, Weehaw pops that ult again with the BKB. They're able to find the Disruptor finally. So it's a two for nothing to start this fight. Zitrex still has a meta. Pops the BKB. He needs to get this Sunder off pretty soon here. We'll get it off onto Weehaw, who's now on the retreat they're gonna find mind control and that is a dual damage for hesta joe a damage and with that that is a damage point he has won 46 duels very impressive performance <laughs> yes he had oh my god what did i miss 100 away from finishing that nimbus uh looks like scotty has now been picked up oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. he's gonna jump on top of hesta joe mm. tasty that delight Lord. I would say the ones close to the river are just those ward spots are really powerful. They have a Zeus, you know, like uh, gotta, oh, okay, stolen uh, sunder. You guys, uh, his brother was playing the first 10 minutes of the game for him. I think his dog. <laughs> I didn't want to go that far. Jesus <laughs> Christ. <laughs> Oh, Centaur initiated on. Swap is here. That's the Joe. Has the duel available. Stampede is available as well. That's a double oh, that's duel. Really is he going to get killed? He will. And he will get shredded shortly after. Actually, is living for now. Gets four stopped out. Weehaw getting slowed thanks to the Scotty on Zitrax. It's a two for, not, two for one, but the buyback on Grimstroke. And now Rubik has Hesta Joe and company completely decimating. Very nicely done. Miracle being the nuisance that he is. Oh, the silence not quite there in time. Such but I kind of bounce on that and they can just get easy kills. So I think both are good and I I don't really mind them. My bigger question is if the Bloodstone is now a Tinker item that you get. All right, Koro's gonna sacrifice himself here to get the Roche. I think that's, and it's a hallow. Radiant <laughs> Your brain is hollow. Wait, what is a hallow specifically? Good question. Let's ask mean? JK Rowling. Oh, Tinker's in trouble. Tinker is oh, fucking dead. And the duel to boot. But Weehaw comes in and cleans up the Disruptor, and he gets the Abyssal Blade onto the Legion Commander. Was it worth it, Singularity? Maybe. I don't know, actually. <laughs> it's pretty even. Thinker's dead. Zeus has been oh, Weehaw, Shannon. his Aegis just... What's that? BKB on Zeus, Zeus has Shannon. BKB, okay. Zeus has BKB, Shannon. Sounds good. Zeus is going to pop the ult, and Tinker dies immediately. Holy oh, storm. crap, that was fast. Oh, that's a good storm. Be popped by Team Nigma. Nice hook stop onto one. Tinker's going to buy back in the game now. This could be a pretty big turnaround. Yo, has As Rex pops the BKB, mind control getting kited up. Or to use Stampede. Kuroki coming in, gets the swap. Mind Control looks to be dead for that last right click, but Weehaw jumps in, trying to take out Zitrax, and they will do so with the Dagon from Miracle. A duel? And now the duel coming in, and okay. that is a Hesta Joe death. So Miracle, extra damage for you. Very useful on a Tinker, of course. Oh, looks like they're gonna get a glimpse on Kuroki, their usual target. He's pretty tanky, though. They're a little bit hesitant here. Hesta Joe wants to jump in. Inks one, nice double ult here from Grimstroke. Grimstroke, in fact. Eventual Spirit dies as well, so technically a one-for-one one buyback onto the Legion Commander who died. Mind Control BKB is now over. That's a you question. Know. I guess we'll have to wait and see. Weeha hovering over this double damage room. Spell Prism is now on Zeus. That could be a big oh, one. Mind Control for that. Mind Control. Oh, there's the Abyssal Blade and a stolen Soulbind used again. And two easy, easy kills as Team Nigma crushing this fight. A buyback onto the Disruptor. But not even a remotely close fight here. Slaying the game, no way. So, just a positioning error that is extremely costly here. Zeus will have to buy back as well. Starting to do some damage here. Disruptor ult on the backside on the Tinker, but there comes Ursa crushing. Tinker 1 HP. Oh my god, he's gonna die. Two for nothing, make it three for nothing, as Zitrax finally does get a kill, but at what cost? Miracle able to go back to the base. We'll be back shortly. A bit too overwhelming, and this should more than likely spell the end of the game. 
Unless we ha, um, <laughs> unless we had that we ha thing, crazy shit, come but on it was top good. Of Blade. But that'll be more than enough to take him out. Good one. The buyback is here for the Arcana Terra Blade, but he doesn't have meta, so yeah, not the greatest. Oh my FPS! Holy jeez! March on the machines just destroys me apparently. That, this in this game, losing one lane of Rax is not the end of the world, but they have to be they have to be playing as a unit now. You can't split up like they've done anymore. Well, I got Coral. That's two minutes specifically, but I would be way too tempted to get the old Ags essentially. Mm. Yeah, I think. GH. Ooh, he's. <laughs> Hesta Joe and forced out his blade now. Mind control. Oh boy. Oh! Grimstroke completely he was decimated. Really out of position. And with that, the Roshan is now going to go to Team Enigma in all likelihood. Ursa can just clean this bad boy up. I don't think they're going to let them have it. They have to fight here. Nimbus. Will be Nimbus killed off. was swiftly taken care of. Illusion. Stampede is available in five seconds as well. Weeha. That's an axe storm. It's an axe storm. It's pretty good. And Zidrax able to pop the BKB as long, along with his metamorphosis. And the Aegis will go to mind control along with the Roshan kill themselves. As Zidrax now on the run. So a disaster of sorts as GH duels Hesta Joe and wins. <laughs> oh man, that feels bad. <laughs> Yep. Sell something. No, terribly. He has to get it. Oh, terrible. Yeah. But he needs the courier. You can't buy refresh in base anymore. You need to buy the. That's rough. Yeah. Components. Oh, this yep. looks to be the end of game one, most likely. Zitrax is going to be dying right at the steps of this fountain. And the throne shall get destroyed. So, T1.